friends, what up? Hope you are doing good. Wanted to just do a quick little toot, quick little tutorial here um, on just where I'm putting my pick, like where I'm holding and like placing my pick when I'm doing like finger picking and stuff. Um, I've gotten a couple people just kind of ask me on Instagram and then on um, uh, email, just, hey, where are you putting and like hiding your pick when you're doing finger picking? And then like you seem to really be able to just kind of like bust it out really quickly to get into like some strumming if you know if i'm doing finger picking on the first verse and then i have to go into a strum for the pre-chorus or the chorus so just wanted to give you guys a little breakdown on to what i'm doing with this little guy where i'm putting it um so for me i i just i i forget how i learned but you know probably looking on youtube google something like that but i found that the easiest way for me is actually to um, put it, um, I don't know if you can see this, but I usually like right in this, this middle part here of my finger, I put the pick here and then I kind of like press it in there and I pinch it with my, um, with the other part of my, I guess the lower part of my, of my knuckle of the inside of my finger, whatever you want to call it. So basically your middle like this middle part here <laughs> whatever that is the knuckle you basically what i do is i put it there pin bring that down pinch it and then i kind of like i don't want to say i dig this bottom part into my into my into the skin but it's just skin like you know skin there so it's not gonna really hurt anything so i i just i've always done it this way because I feel like it, it allows me to like finger pick still. I'm still using my middle finger to do finger picking, um, to pick, you know, pick the strings. And it's just, I feel like I'm not gonna lose it. Like it's not gonna pop out of my hands or out of my finger and you know, all heck is gonna break loose. I'm pretty, I feel pretty good that I'm, I'm locking that thing in there pretty tightly. And it's easy for me to get out too. So it's just right there. So that's what I do. That's just kind of how I've always done it. Um, I, I think I've tried to do it a couple of different ways, like um, putting it between like your, your uh, middle and a ring finger and like having it pop out a little bit that way, but still keeping it in there and still finger picking. I'll be honest, I think I've tried it that way and that just, to be honest, it seems to be like a little bit too much work for me. You know, if you've seen my videos, you've seen my tutorials, my lessons, my channel, I just try to make things as simple as possible. And I feel like with this way, you know, I'm just not, those, those aren't my two good fingers, I guess. And there's just not a lot of like, I'm not used to holding them together. And I felt like a lot of times, even now, if I would try to finger pick, you know, even if I was just using, if I was using this simple picking pattern, see, literally it just dropped out of my fingers right there. That's why I don't like it. It's just, you know, when you're trying to finger pick, you, you don't want to have to think about things. You don't want to have to think about, okay, I need to make sure I squeeze these two fingers tightly enough so the pick doesn't come out of my, um, fingers so so I have just always done it like this just kind of pinch it in there lock it in and it just frees me up to be able to just kind of frees you up to be able to do that so you know just a quick little fyi if you did want to just you know kind of get used to doing that it's really easy because your 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 fingers are are, are are already at a little bit of kind of a slant because you're like you know you're finger picking 
So just it's really easy just to pop that thing in there and then pinch it. And then when you need to pull it out, just and then you start going and then when you need to just boom, just like that. When you need to go back into finger picking, you're good to go. So I mean like you could also do other things like putting it like resting it on your if you're sitting and playing, you could rest it on your um, uh, thigh or your knee. If you wanted to rest it up here, you know, you could easily do that. Just pick it up when you need to strum. Um, I've seen some guitars where you can actually just kind of like put this thing in um, and kind of like rig it into something where you can easily just kind of grab it. But I don't know. I think for me, just the easiest way has always just been to hold it like this. That way when I'm finger picking, I can easily go into a strum. At the end of the song, if we're, if we're doing a soft moment, I can just easily go back into my finger picking. And then if we're building it up again, I can easily pull it out. So I would do that. If you have questions on it, let me know. Just leave a comment in the, in the, uh, leave a question in the comments below. Head over to the channel, my channel, say what's up, go to the community tab, say hello, say where you're from. Uh, I'd love to connect with you here on YouTube, on the channel, uh, in the comments, on the community tab. So definitely do that. And then, uh, yeah, if you have any questions, just leave a comment below. And hope this helps you. If you have any issues with it, just let me know. Otherwise, um, I will catch you in the next one.